greetings guys uh, we're doing another video and it's actually we actually were here last Friday when we did a Epping Forest Hangman's Hill walk and it was a very interesting walk you could probably see on my channel where I actually recorded the seance which was on audio and it's doing quite well it's got over 200 views which is brilliant I think it was 220 last time I checked. Thanks guys for watching. Anyway, we came here and we did the seance. It's the first experience I've been involved in. I've never done that before, so it was very surreal. And there's about 22 of us, and we all formed into a semicircle. And we had a medium, who was obviously the, the guide of the walk. He was a medium as well, and he was conducting it. He was obviously um, made to trying to sort of communicate with spirits whilst we were in a semicircle. Uh, it was a very interesting experience, it was about 20 minutes long, a lot happened I think. Uh, there were some people getting affected by the spirits which were being called on by the medium and Kaylee was affected as well. Uh, she's probably, one, I think she was one of the first persons who was affected and she did, she was taken over by the spirit. So Kaylee, do you want to talk about your experiences last Friday during yeah. the seance? Because it wasn't really just that taking it over, it was like more of a spiritual connection. Right. Because like my aura fused with like his spiritual energy, and like it felt really, it just like felt so surreal because I was like right here, I was just like holding his hands with like a girl's hand, and I was doing like this, rocking back and forth. And at one point I was like that. Yeah. Like just like this forward, like this. Right. And because like it was like very like, interesting because um, the, the, the guy just said, well, if you're there and if you think that your life has been, has been taken away from you and you, and you think that it's unfair that it's been hung, murdered on, 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 on his hill, uh, please just like m make yourself known and he made, and he just like fused with my spirit. Right, okay. So, of course I was going like this. Yeah, so it was, a f it, it was, yeah, was affecting like you then slightly. Forward. Right, yeah. okay. It wasn't fully affecting you but it because was that affecting you enough. Because I was aware of what I was doing. You were also in control but you felt a um, an aura yeah, yeah, come upon yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, because um, this spirit had been like he was like very angry and, yeah. and upset that he just that like, had that he, that his life terminated at yeah. this point right so it should here. Be, yeah. And at one point he just like saw the spirits of uh, the family who's uh, who involved in the murder and yeah, event. and she was just like so livid. And what about the end of the seance? You had this feeling around your neck. I mean, yeah, because I had like this uh, this tense like, feeling around my neck. It was yeah. like a hammer's noose. Right. So that could have been the cause of death then. Yeah. So I think it must have been that like, hun. Yeah. Um, but but obviously because like um, coming here and also just like um, like being in the cold. Uh, the flu has has a result, so right, I was yeah. like, um, I wasn't feeling well. Um, so I don't think it was anything supernatural. Uh, do you, so, so the spirit, do you what, what do you know anything from from what you experienced? Do you know how old he is, or no. I guess you don't know his name, I suppose. No. You no, just know he's an angry no, man who's no. gone through a, a horrible experiences, no, and he's yeah, obviously yeah, yeah, annoyed. I think because like even though he just like, pushed me down to It wasn't aggressive to towards ground. yourself. It wasn't aggressive towards me. Just angry at the situation. Was, it was just so angry towards to the situation. Yeah. Because like, obviously like there's so many spirits that in this area. It's a hot spot for spirits. Um, yeah, that's why I thought we'd do the EVP. Uh, That's why um, a lot of people was affected. Yeah, there was quite a few people yeah. affected, wasn't there? It was about six, seven. Or they, had that, they had that. They just um, coughing. It was and she, a coughing um, fit. She felt burning in her throat, and I think because if you're being hand, yeah, and if you just like 
was dropped from the tree. Yeah. And the, 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 the forces are pulling you, you downwards, then obviously you get that spoon Hang in your throat. Hangman's Hill is just right up there. Uh, it's literally five, ten minutes away. And this is where we did the seance. So what I'm going to attempt to do now is try my best to communicate the spirit that affected Kaylee. I'm just going to put the EVP on now and see if we get anything. I'm just going to get the EVP out. Uh, like so I said... Right here because I remember he had a, a ditch there or something. Yeah. That, that's what, um, so you remember it? Yeah. And, uh, and it was right here that we just like... Um, that um, that yeah. was because I can remember the seeing those that hill there. Okay. All right, I'm I'm gonna record it now, yeah, and then uh, I'm gonna try and speak to him, ask him a few questions. All right, it's um, recording now. Okay, it's, it's running. All right. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just gonna try my best to communicate with him. Bear in mind, there's no name or anything, or we don't know any background information about him, so we're just taking a chance, really. Um, yeah, I want to communicate with the spirit that was here last Friday night during a seance which was conducted here. Um, I noticed you affected Kaylee because um, I was there and I witnessed it. And obviously you're very, very angry of what happened to you and I'm really sorry for what happened as well. And I, don't, I have I much respect for you as well. I don't mean you any disrespect. And I do appreciate you've had a horrible experience, and obviously that explains why you're obviously angry. Um, if you can communicate us through the EVP, it'll be much obliged. The EVP is on now. I'm going to stay silent for a minute, and hopefully we can hear something. All right, just one second. Okay, I'm going to ask you a few questions as well. I don't know how you can communicate with me through the PvP, but um, we're thinking that you got hung when you died. Is that true? Is that your cause of death, being hanged? Are you at peace or not? Are you angry? Angry what happened to you? I need to ask you I need to ask you this. Why did you affect Kaylee and no one else? Did you mean Kaylee harm or not? Does your spirit reside in this area? really sorry what happened to you really apologetic it's horrible what you experienced and we mean no disrespect like i said we just want to communicate with you and we want something because obviously you've had an awful experience to get here and you obviously affected kaylee so we just want to speak to you but so also, if you can give us anything also, I'd like to say, say something. Um, yeah um even though I have no idea who you are or what your name is, um, but I felt like a spiritual connection with you when that sales was taking place. And I just say, but thank you for that everything that, that you've done for me. And you know what? So I just hope that you are at peace. And I'm just like so sorry about what happened to you. I have no idea. Um, why you just died, or who just that like, caused it? But I just hope to God that that they are just like in, in hell right now for you know that like, for just like, taking your life away, you know. And 
I just like feel that you know that your story has to be told and yeah we, that's, that's why we want you to communicate with us because yeah. we want to know what happened and can you tell us your name as well if you're able to all right okay we're we're gonna leave now when we we want to say thank you for communi- trying to communicate with us and trying to sort of put your aura onto Kaylee and we wish you well and we hope you're in peace and we're gonna leave now yeah goodbye all right we're gonna leave now and later when we get back we can review the footage um, the EVP if we hear anything we'll put it on my channel all right guys bye, bye.